Liverpool, two pivotal decisions in that game. Let's start with the penalty claim. Alan Shearer, Tim Howard, what did you see in that one? Um, well, it, was, uh, it happened so quickly, to be honest with you. I was expecting the ball to be played upfield and it was rather a poor back pass and I was caught quite a distance from play. And basically, at the end of the day, I was just totally uncertain that there'd been any contact. Obviously, I've seen it on the television. There is a bit of contact there. And I suppose Newcastle can count itself a little bit unlucky. You would have given that penalty had you had that view? Oh, absolutely. I mean, just from where I am, unless I'm absolutely 100% certain that there's been contact, then I can't give the penalty. And that was the case. Another decision which perhaps Man United feel will have gone against them in the second half. Michael Silvestre had a goal disallowed. What was your view of that one? Well, as soon as the corner came over, I'd blown long before the ball had gone into the net. Um, Silvestre had his arms all over the, over the defender and a clear case of um, you know, a foul. So it was impeding, was it? Oh, absolutely, yeah. I, I felt there was a, enough contact there to have uh, uh, impeded the Newcastle defender. You've also seen that one again. Do you stick by that decision now, having seen a replay? Yeah, I'm happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> but not happy with the other decision? Uh, obviously a little bit disappointed from a personal point of view because we like to get the big ones right. But, you know, people need to understand that it happens so quick and I've got a split second to, to um, make that decision. You know, in hindsight, watching it in slow motion replay, then... You know, it does look a penalty. Appreciate you coming out and you for your honesty. Thanks very much.